hello guys and welcome back in this video we'll talk about the second phase of programming that is understanding data structures and algorithm this video will uh, contain the supreme guide and roadmap whatever you need to understand about data structures and algorithm okay means uh, when to start which topic and what is the uh, right way to start data structures and algorithm okay so uh, I have divided into this video into three parts the guide the roadmap and then we'll be discussing the sites which are important okay so let's get into guide okay so for this so here we have okay basically data structures and algorithm tells us that it is data structures and algorithm so first of all let us see what data structures are important for us to you know understand the topic so we have basic three type of data structures we will see in the upcoming videos okay so linear data structures non-linear data structures and one more topic that is bit manipulation okay so this topic bit manipulation uh, is nothing but you know working with zeros and ones x or x nor yes then if we talk about then yes x nor left shift right shift all these things so this is bit manipulation and how we can use it in programming okay then we are having linear data structures so in that we are having array strings linked list stack deck uh, q and dq and deck and matrix okay so we all we will be discussing everything in python we don't have array or let's say array as list okay so this is linear data structures when you talk about non-linear data structures we are having trees binary search trees heap graph tree uh segment trees and disjoints disjoint sets so these are all the things that you should know when you complete your data structures when you we can say that i have completed data structures that means we have covered all these okay data structures now when we talk about algorithms i have divided algorithms into two uh two topics that is analysis of the algorithm and then the design of algorithm where we'll be creating our own uh, designs so for analysis we are having different algorithms or different uh, concepts you should know that is asymptotic notation which contains big o notation theta notation or symptotic notations okay omega notations then time and space complexity of an algorithm okay you're going to have a uh, recursion for this also yes you're going to have master theorem we're going to have recursion tree method okay how do we analyze the loops okay all these things and space complexity of course and then we talk about searching we have namely linear search and binary search as an algorithm and we talk about sorting so these are all the sorting algorithms we should know at the end of these you can say course or foundation okay so bubble sort selection sort insertion sort and all those then we have a technique called hashing so we'll be using that also we'll be understanding that also and then this was the analysis part here we'll be analyzing what exactly linear search does what exactly bub, uh, binary search does okay what is the complexity of it you will see what exactly complexity is okay then we have design in design we have we, here we're going to create our own algorithms like we, we, here we have the greedy method right so greedy method we have different algorithms we will be understanding we will be analyzing these algorithms we'll be designing these uh, the algorithm for these problems and we'll be applying it in you know different uh questions also okay then we have divide and conquer okay minimum maximum problem searching sorting problem matrix multiplication graph search we have dfs and bfs yes depth for search breadth first search then we have diastras algorithm and Bell bellman ford algorithm we have more algorithms of it then for dynamic programming one of the vast concept of data structures and algorithm we have matrix chain uh okay zero one knapsack multi-stage graph egg dropping problem and many more okay then for backtracking we have rat and maze uh then sudoku problems and endquin problems these was uh, this was all about data structures and algorithm what you need to know okay what you need to know about data structures and algorithm everything okay so now moving forward towards the roadmap how you should go forward with the topics okay so in this uh this is just a brief i would like to tell you the whole pdf or the word file you will be getting where you can have everything you know which problems you should solve for getting onto the concept and what are the practice problems okay practice problems i'll be giving you sites from where you can find your practice problems of that particular topic but 
uh, which topic you should know so that you should get the concept clearly is over here like in the topic of recursion you should solve all these problems Joseph's problem towers of Hanoi problems okay and the whole PDF as well as the doc file will be provided in the link uh, provided the link will be in the description okay all these things very detailed okay uh, so let's move so this is just an overview like introduction then will be mathematics recursion manipulation uh, bit manipulation yes what you are going to study in introduction will be like analysis of algorithm order of growth asymptotic notation time and space complexity when you talk about time and space concept co complexity is just, just not about big o okay theta omega but it is about uh, what uh, is in complexity time and space complexity of loops okay what, uh, what if when we use iterative method and what if when we use recursive method all these things then when you talk about maths you should solve problems yes so we have bit manipulation where you know operators you should understand what are the problems like counting set bit okay we uh, we have there is problem called ch uh, check kth bit in the uh, set it is set or not okay something like that then we have recursion so recursion you should know how to analyze recursion and then some problems as i have told you or which is shown in the pdf or the word file that is tower of any problem okay subset uh, sub, uh, subset of a set problem like this then we have array so in array you should know what are the type of arrays the introduction like what exactly arrays is what are the types like multi uh, multi dimensional array 1d array 2d array yes then what operations like searching insertion deletion okay array versus other data structures and some problems like left rotation of an array okay maximum sub array sum okay so if we consider like if we consider like we have an array okay what is the continuous array which is having the maximum sum okay all these problems we'll be discussing in the upcoming videos okay then for uh, the next will be so uh, searching so in searching what the introduction okay like linear search binary search some problems like uh, what is the index of last occurrence in the sorted array okay then peak element what is the peak element yes we will be understanding all these things okay and some problems and one more approach that is called as two point approach okay then we have sorting there are different type of sorting algorithms and uh, partition is one of the topic in it and what exactly you know sorting is then matrix okay matrix multi-dimensional matrix what exactly matrix is travel sort of matrix like spiral form okay then boundary boundary traversal then snake pattern traversal of matrix okay transposing rotating searching problems searching and problems okay all these things all these things are returned in this pdf so one thing you can take away from this we uh, from this video or uh, is uh, from this video is this that you should know what exactly you're going to study or what you want to study for you know for understanding the concepts so of matrix you should know what exactly is matrix multiplication yes where it is matrix multiplication how you how do you write a code for it right then check the element is present in the row or column and sort whatever okay all these things are necessary then you can solve the pra uh, practice problems and back from uh, from where you can solve the practice problems you can move to the section okay so similarly we have matrix and uh, then you should study hashing so this is the this is the sequence particular sequence which topic should be you know uh, you should understand when you are uh, when you do searching sorting then you should understand matrix then you should understand you know hashing okay then collision open addressing double hashing everything then we have you know strings if i am not wrong yes we have strings in strings you should know different algorithms like rabin uh, rabin uh, uh, rabin cap algorithm we have kmp uh, one thing that is not mentioned that is z algorithm is there okay boyer's more algorithm is there so you should understand those algorithms of strings uh, strings and some problems of course okay after string we have a linked list so in linked list you should know under what exactly linked list are double linked list we have circular linked lists loop problems yes all these things all the different implementations with its operation like inserting printing and deleting with all operations you should understand all the types of linked lists yes so then 
it is you should you should understand what exactly stack is yes in fix post fix you should you should be unfamiliar with these terms but it is important when you study you go through the video one again one one more after you study all these things okay then you have queues then uh it is d uh, dq or you say deck okay then trees okay then in trees you should know different type of traversal methods in order pre-order post order level order spiral order okay what exactly binary trees is then one of the second most important binary search tree okay that is what are the operations what is self balancing tree balancing trees evil trees red black trees okay and some problems to name a few problems uh there can be the ceiling of a key okay you will understand check the check the following trees bst that is binary search tree or not okay what will be the top view of the binary tree what will be the bottom view of the travel uh you know binary tree and more problems like these okay then after a binary search tree there is a topic that is heap in heap you should know uh, the heap sort we have already seen but the heap implementation of heap sort okay how do you, uh, you you will get to know concept much better so heap sort binary heap what is priority queue one of the most important topic also yes then we have greedy or, or no we have graph okay in graph this is the most important topic that is graph and dynamic program is also there but graph is also important where you will be you know understanding introductions and different representations like adjacency matrix representation adjacency list representation binary search tree oh, sorry sorry uh, breadth first search and depth first search algorithms and its problem okay shortest path algorithms like diestra's algorithm bellman ford okay then we have two shells minimum span oh, sorry what is what is yes minimum spanning tree algorithms like primes algorithm okay Kosa Raju's articulation points, what is bridges and graphs, uh, uh, Tarjan's algorithm, all these uh, algorithms are in, important. And once again, I like to tell you, like all these things, all about graph you need to know is here. Okay, what problems you should solve is also in this particular doc file. You can get the link in the description. Okay, after graph, you should be understanding what exactly greedy is. Okay, greedy is one of the method. Uh, which is used to you know design algorithms and some examples are like activity selection problems fractional uh, knapsack and then we have job sequencing problems and stuff okay after greedy uh, dynamic programming okay introduction memoization and tabulation problems one of the important okay this makes this this memoization problem and tabulation problem makes the you know problem very simple and of course recursive okay like to name a few egg dropping problem is over here okay then we have matrix chain multiplication problem longest common subsequence very uh, common example from this particular topic okay so dynamic programming and then we have two very two to three very oh no then it is a uh, backtracking so backtracking you know like concept you should understand what exactly the concept of backtracking is then rat in maze problem and queen's problem so logo problem okay oh, and many more problems and where you can get the problems i'll be discussing further okay then we have two more two very uh two to three very simple topics that is segment trees that is intro uh, introduction construction range and update queries and problems based on it and then we have try data structure you should know what exactly the concept is one of the most common feature or the advantage of try data structure is the autocomplete feature so whatever you have in your phone where you have autocomplete feature while typing so it is because of try data structure right so and the last is uh, disjoint sets okay so where you should know what exactly fine and union operations is union by rank path compression crucial cells or them using disjoint sets and some problems okay now let us discuss where you can find these problems okay so these are all the important sites where you can get you know problems to practice okay to name a few here we have hacker rank okay sorry hacker earth uh here we have hacker earth so let us see where you can exactly get the problems that you need okay so in hacker earth there is a practice section okay there is a practice section where you can see there is something called data structures and algorithm if you want to practice basic programming you can also practice that but here we have data structures and algorithm where 
if you talk about data structures if uh, today you have studied array then you can get all the questions of 1d array 2d array or multi-dimensional array stacks queues hash tables and lists everything okay so everything about data structures will be the whole module of data structures will be over here right similarly uh, for algorithm we have different type of algorithms so we have different type of problem set for here in this hacker rank we have different type of problem set for uh, of the particular topic to solve yes so this was and if you are you know like you want to revise you want to overview here in this site you you have a thing called code monk where you can practice by concepts like arrays and strings five to six problems you will be having over here like sorting problems and much more okay it will get unlocked okay there will be checkpoint like if you have finished arrays and string then you'll be having sorting okay see over here you can see like solve at least four problems three to four problems so that to access searching so first you need to solve at least two to three problems four problems from these two concepts and then you can move to you know searching part yes so this is a hacker rank similarly we have uh, there is a of course this is well known site that is geek for geeks there is a practice section in this where they have you know like topic wise data structures algorithms and if you want to practice languages also there is a language also but there is no python i don't know why but you can uh, you can go through like 921 arrays problem similarly strings and algorithm like bit magic over here also there is okay so you have 185 problems practice problems to solve after you get the concept of bit magic okay after completing you know this much questions of bit uh, bit manipulation over here you have two to three problems which will be discussed uh, which will be discussed over here and then you have 185 problems to practice moving forward then we have lead code one of the most famous site again for you know practice there is here also you're going to get tag wise problem okay uh, you can if you had studied uh, let's say arrays today so you're going to get arrays questions over here okay like arrays all the arrays questions level wise questions with you know try easy first then uh then medium and then hard of course okay if you go like this then one more feature of uh lead code i would like to mention that is the context a uh, contest section where you can take part in weekly contests as well as uh bi-weekly contests okay this is very helpful but you should have you know knowledge about uh, uh knowledge about these data structures and algorithms so first practice by using this problem uh, uh problem site and then you can go for uh contests also and then one more section over here that i would like to mention is an explore section where you can get uh the questions of different companies yes you can have different companies questions by taking the premium i guess and then you can also study the uh study the problems uh concepts wise like if i want to uh, study recursion then we will be having recursion problems we will be having gray uh, graphs arrays okay google interview that is premium but you can assess you know recursion part okay all these questions are like you know chapter wise and uh, you have like over here in recursion you have 21 problems okay so this is I like this feature of lead code where you can have problems using tags and you know these set of problems are in, uh, important to understand recursion so these are all the questions you should know yes so this is lead code then we have one more very famous uh, code chef okay in code chef there is a tag in problems and uh, wait in pro uh, practice and learn there is something called DSA learning series where you can start learning by here okay like wait a minute yes here we have uh, they have live session links and the hint links and when you go to any problem uh, you can get the questions related to it okay like these are all the questions related to stl but stl it is not there in python but we have uh, we have sets we have unordered sets in python right priority queue will be understanding so these are all the uh, first you understand the concept then come here 
you know practice these are all the options that i'm telling you okay here also there is code chef so in code chef oh sorry code forces here also we have problem set with tags okay this is pretty uh, high level okay here greedy math greedy i got data structures okay with tags you can find problems over here also similarly in hacker uh, rank uh, where you will be having two particular modules named as data structures and algorithm where you can practice for different questions okay all languages are accepted in all these platforms okay so data structures and algorithm this is and at last if you want to have or if you want to know the articles okay if you want to get uh, get to know what exactly concept is and if you are ready to you know uh, have articles of if if you are likely to read articles then all the topics all the concepts all these questions you will be getting the solution of or you will be getting understanding the topic of in this site this is the not god of uh what programming stuff okay you can get anything machine learning competitive programming python java c++ algorithm data structures algorithm you can get everything in it okay so these for these you must know this okay so this is it for this video where we have discussed the road map what you need to know how you need to know and from where you can uh, you know get all these things if you are interested in having a book for algorithms uh, there is a book called introduction to algorithm the link of that i'll be giving in the description okay so this is it all the links will be in the description of these sites also okay you can go through that site and see okay so this is it uh thanks for watching and bye